Hey guys, how are you doing? This is Jaser, who is not good at algorithms. Uh, in this video, I'm going to take a look at 270 closest binary search tree value, given a non-empty binary search tree, BST, okay, and a target value, find the value in the BST that is closest to the target. Given a target value is a floating point, you're guaranteed to have the only one unique value in the BST that is close to that value, target which is like this, target 3.7, of course, it's obviously uh, closes to 4, so return 4, right? But how we do that, uh, how we, can we solve this problem? Well, it's BST, uh, the first idea, it will be binary search. We search first, we search for 3.7, right? It might in, uh, in on the node or just uh, between two nodes. Well, for 4, it's not 4, it's smaller than 4, so it must be in the left tree. Right between the, the the or between the left tree, like between the left tree and four, right? For this case, we'll be search on four and then two and search three, and just bigger than three. So, and uh, actually, it's between three and four, right? So yeah, I, we can just uh, search on the bi binary tree and uh, along the path, we can update it the closest the value, right? Yeah, so the idea is clear. Uh, binary search target update closest uh, value along the path. Cool. Let's say let's result equals infinity. Uh, while because we're going to do the search, we don't need to use we, we we don't need recursion, right? Okay, so for the irregular case, if root is null, return ah, we're guaranteed there is a value, so it's only one unique value, so root is not null. So let p equals no, let's node equals root. We will go until node is not null, right? So for each pass, we will check if ch update the result, update the result, right? So if if uh, math abs result node val target okay if a node val it is target then result is target and we just break for the other case nothing is found we should search search it right so math if uh, if math is uh, If it, is, if it itself we break, if it is closer to the target, we update. Also, we update the result. Math abs target is smaller than math math uh, no, uh, results minus target abs result equals target. Oh no, result equals node value. And then we need to go to next one, right? So if uh, node val, no, 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 if target is bigger than node val, then we go to the right, right tree, right? So node equals node right. For the other case, because it's equal, it's bigger, then it's smaller, right? So node equals node left. And when they match the when the node of their leaf node leaf node, uh, this while loop will end. And finally, we could return the result, right? So let's review once more between we before we submit the result. Okay, for we got four, we updated to result to four, and then we because four is bigger than it, we move two, right? And uh, we check two. Mm, if two is closer. Nah, 
and uh, because and it's bigger than two, so we move to the right. Uh huh. Yeah, I found a mistake. We should add else here, and we go to three. Three is closer. No. And is it smaller? Yes. So we go to the left, but it's null. We stop. Cool. It should work. Let's submit. Cool. We're accepted. And uh, what's time complexity? Well, it's binary search, binary search, so it's log n, right? Worst case, it's linear time when the tree is uh, is just a straight line. Uh, for space, well, we use a variable to keep track of the node. It's constant. Cool. Okay, so that's all for this one. Uh, hope it helps. See you next time. Bye-bye.